Here's an easy DIY wall art that you can do yourself for Valentine's Day. So the supplies you will need are a poster board. Um, this poster board I picked up from the Dollar Tree. And it has, um, I think, about six different types and colors. It has red, gold, green, blue. So it has various colors. Then you need a pack of googly eyes. Those you can also pick up from the Dollar Tree. And then you will need some type of heart. This is a paper heart. Um, you can pick up, you can use a foam heart if needed. Any type of heart will do. Then you'll need some type of liquid adhesive. Um, of your choice you can use Elmer's glue you can use this um, adhesive you can use a hot glue gun whatever you like then um, scissors are optional because you may have to cut down the poster board to fit inside um, the frame that you choose this frame right here I picked up from the thrift store I'm not sure of the size I haven't measured it but um, you know, you could pick whatever size frame you would like, 8 by 10, 11 by 14, whatever size you would like to use. And then also you're going to need to use your um, computer to do this font. The font that I have here is a size 42 and I use the font is called Algerian. So the first thing you will do, you will start gluing the googly eyes onto your heart um, you can glue them how, whatever pattern you choose um, I'm gonna glue mine I'm gonna fill up the entire heart because that's the pattern I like the best I did a dry fit to make sure I like the way it looked and I tried different options and the one that I liked the best was filling up the entire heart so this is what it'll start looking like once you start um, gluing the googly eyes onto your heart also, I used, um, like I told you guys, I used that liquid glue adhesive, and it didn't work out so good. So what I did was um, I grabbed my super glue, and I started using super glue. As you can see, you can see my daughter's feet in the video. She's, she's the one gluing the hearts on with me. Um, but yeah, so I advise either using a hot glue gun or super glue. And if you use either one, make sure you use just a small, tiny amount. You don't need um, that much to glue the eyes on. So I'll finish up, and then I'll show you guys what the heart looks like once all the googly eyes are on. So this is what the heart will look like once you finish putting on all your googly eyes. All right, so then you're going to take the heart and then you're just going to use glue. You can use tape. I used the super glue and then I just glued it to my printable that I made up. And it looks like this once you have it glued and in place. And then what you need to do is just put the poster board, um, if needed, cut it down to size. And then you put it inside the frame and then you will put your artwork inside in front of the poster board and you will close it up and this is what it will come look this is the outcome the final outcome also um this frame I, I bought it last year at the Goodwill so I actually had it for a while but yeah so I know the Dollar Tree sells um some frames you can pick up there inexpensively but yeah this is what it it looks like so I'm gonna put this over my computer where the kids do their homework and where my printer is and then I'll let you see what it looks like on the wall so there you have it that's the final project and that's what it will wind up looking at looking like another suggestion another thing that you can use instead of using poster board you can go to Michaels or any craft store and get some cardstock so you can do like a design get some decorative decorative cardstock to make it even prettier, the background. I just used what I had on hand. I already had the poster board, and I didn't feel like going out and buying more stuff. So I just used what I had on hand, and this is what it looked like. So hopefully you enjoy it, you like it, um, and you guys will do something similar. If you do, if you're thinking about trying it, let me know. It's very simple. My four-year-old daughter was able to do it, so I'm sure anybody else could if she can do it. 
All right. Well, thank you for watching. Until next time.